name is Bridget Meyer and I'm a second year currently uh, working with the Magnus Collection to go through their collection of um, archived songs and music, particularly from the early 1900s. And so what I do is there's a there's like a spreadsheet and it has all the listed things and I go through catalogs and I find recordings of them from other institutions and information about them to add to the catalog. And I love it because it gives me a chance to explore a bunch of different songs that I would have never heard of, spoken word, music, all sorts of things, um, and to talk about them with people who are experts. And I've been with the Magnus for a couple of years now doing a project on Jewish Islamic art. Um, I have loved the Magnus. I've, I've loved every second that I've been involved with it, um, both, both in the olden days when we were in person and after this move to online, I've always felt engaged. I've always felt involved. I've always felt like an integral part of the team. The Roman Vishnia collection is this large, expansive digital um, and physical archive of images taken by Roman Vishniak in Europe before World War II. Um, many of them are of families, of Jewish families and children that not long thereafter were murdered during the Holocaust. Um, as well as being the meaningful historical connection to my Jewish heritage that this project is. The apprenticeship has really introduced me to various museum practices and techniques concerning um, collection cataloging, especially in the digital sphere, um, researching and fact checking existing information in museum databases all around the world, as well as the Magnus database. Itself. As a history major, I really wanted to engage in research that told a story. And as a global studies major, I'm fascinated by the richness of other cultures and about learning uh, about other people's experiences and hardships. And as a journalism minor, I'm very interested in investigative work. And over the course of the past year or so in the pandemic, I've really enjoyed having Zoom meetings and working on spreadsheets with Francesco and Sheer, and they're just such kind people. And it really made this, made the most out of it. And I hope one day, maybe soon, to actually see the prints that I've been working with in person and finally go to the museum for the first time. So it's been really fun. I specifically work with the research group uh, working towards the Islamic Jewish Museum Directory, and that's been really enrich enriching for multiple reasons. I am super grateful for the research team and for getting to collaborate with students who may share my interests in Jewish history and culture, but approach such topics from such different, vastly, vastly, vastly different perspectives. Um, and I'm also super grateful for the um, leadership of that research group, um, specifically, and of the museum, uh, specifically Francesco and Sheer who um, really make research like a creative and imaginative endeavor. And I feel super grateful to have their own, um, both of them as mentors and to also have their um, time and their insights and their support as I continue to progress, um, both in my studies at Cal and through my work at the museum and also hopefully beyond. There's no URAP project that I know of on this campus that um, allows you to be as involved, as deeply connected to the work that's being done, not just as an accessory, but as like a main part of the team, a fixture of the project, like the Magnus does. Um, it's really, it's really incredible. There is this large amount of independence that the Magnus gives you to conduct your own research on the things that you are really interested in for your field of study and in the best way that is suitable for you. Um, I've really enjoyed it so far and um, could recommend to anyone. I love the people. I love the, the project. Um, there's nothing that I don't recommend about the Magnus. And if you're looking for, for a research opportunity, I highly, highly recommend it. Happy Cal Day.